The whole th theme of the booth this year is connected retail experiences, and it's really three key pillars. We've got connecting the, uh, the store experience, or connecting the stores, connecting the enterprise, and connecting commerce. And really, those key things really boil together, and we've got some great solutions in there that support all three of those. The connecting the stores is really about connecting the store experience and the customer. In an economic time like today, there's really, it's almost imperative to start to look for what's differentiating you as a retailer that enables you to build a tighter relationship with your customer and really cater to what they're looking for, which is a much more enhanced experience. If you think about what they're used to outside of the retail brick and mortar environment, it's instant access to information. It's really the ability to, in their time, on, in their way, to find the information that they're looking for, whether that's just about your products or across multiple competitors' types of products. They typically don't get that kind of experience in the store. So retailers today are trying to figure out a way and are looking for vendors who can help them create a more compelling experience, whether that's helping themselves with, a, uh, with um, looking up their own information and self-assistance, or whether that's trying to get information from an associate to get that experience done for them. Connecting the enterprise is really more about breaking down the barriers of communication between the various walls that exist in retail. So whether that's among departments within the organization, whether that's breaking down the walls with your supply chain or your partners, or breaking down the walls between stores and the organization, it's really imperative these days to try and get that instant access to, of information to whoever needs it within the organization that can make smart decisions about what needs to be done to drive those experiences we talked about in the store. It's really become a demand-driven retail environment where the consumer's in charge. So based on what they're looking for and the types of experiences, we need to very quickly get that information throughout the organization. The connecting commerce is about trying to create that seamless experience regardless about how or where you're touching the customer. So think about the different ways that you shop today. You can shop online in the web, you may be shopping on your mobile phone, you may be shopping on a store, you may be shopping through a call center. And the customer's beginning to pick up on the fact that if I'm getting a different experience in every one of those areas, I don't have the best connection with the retailer that I'm really expecting uh, to get. And so we're trying to help retailers break down those barriers so regardless of how they're touching that customer, they're getting that seamless experience. Well, we've got some really cool things, especially in the customer um, service and experience area, which is why we're calling this Connected Experiences for Retail. Two really cool things that have really picked up a lot of trash in Microsoft Tag. The reason I love this is it's beginning to tap into the consumer mobility, the devices that they're bringing into the store, and the ability to try and bridge that gap to get to instant, ac instant access to information while they're in that brick and mortar environment. Uh, go check that out, Microsoft Tag, the ability to really just very quickly read a tag and get back instant information on where you are in that area. Windows 7 multi-touch, amazing. It's really kind of the new thing. Surface was a huge hit last year, still a big hit this year. Windows 7 multi-touch, the ability to really see things, interactive, digital, gesturing, looking up that product information, where things are located in the store. Very exciting, very compelling, we're very excited about it.